Tane is reeling after the fallout with the journalist at the hospital. Alf and Rue are doing their best to support him, with Rue sticking by the baby's side in his place. They bring up the possibility of Tane being an emergency foster carer, but he shakes his head, he's already thought about it, and he can't because he's not a permanent resident. Determined, Alf tries talking to Rose about lifting the Avo, but she sadly puts her foot down, the minute Tane laid a finger on that journalist, it was out of her hands. Felicity watches the whole conversation between Tane, Alf, and Rue, conflicted. Tugging on the last thread of hope, Rue and Tane sit down together to look at the application to apply for a permanent residency. However, they're in for a disheartening reality check, it'll take months for that whole process, and even if that gets approved, Tane will have to wait however many more months on top of that to apply to be a carer. Tane suddenly has an idea. Why doesn't Rue take matters into her own hands? She stews on it, the memory of giving up her own daughter for adoption heavy on her mind. She knocks on Alf's door later that night, her mind made up. Maybe she should apply to become Maya's emergency foster carer. Rue is making all the necessary arrangements to apply to be Maya's emergency foster carer, but self-doubt is creeping in. She confides in Alf over her fears, 